I met Joyce through a mutual friend of ours, Larry Tucker, uh, who said this would be a great match. We were uh, introduced to each other uh, by a mutual friend that thought I would play his music well and that perhaps he might want to write for me after he hears me play. We met in Baltimore for the first time. Um, she heard some of my music and I went to see her perform in Baltimore where I live with the Baltimore Symphony Orchestra. By then I had already uh, looked at some of his orchestral works and I thought it was just spectacular. I heard her perform Prokofiev third piano concerto and if this piano concerto is very kinetic you could probably blame it on me watching her play uh, the outer movements of the Prokofiev. Kansas City Symphony is fantastic. It's a treasure. It's just a great band. Uh, in addition to that, Michael Stern has been a great friend and supporter my entire career. And it's just the perfect confluence between the three of us, four of us, including Joyce. First movement of the concerto is a high energy. It uh, takes off right away and it becomes uh, it's very bubbly uh, and exciting. And I think a very uh, special moment is when all that excitement goes away and a very sparse, very uh, lonely, maybe nostalgic second movement starts. It's a wonderful work. It is full of joy, full of bounce, a rip-roaring finale, um, a beautiful slow movement. It is such a privilege to have a hand in bringing new music to life. Certainly in Kansas City it makes it special, and even more so when it's the, uh, the work of a really close friend and somebody that I admire and respect so much. <laughs>